Wait, are you sure it was me? I'm sure it was 100,000% you. How are you so sure? Because I saw it with my eyes. Huh. My eyeballs. Interesting. Guess I'm kind of screwed then. Because, uh, yeah. As soon as I saw you, I was like in the standing in the middle of the scrapyard. I mean, if this route you want to go, uh, by all means, you can go that route. <clears throat> I'm not going to give you resisting, despite the fact that you took off running. I mean, if you saw me get out of a car, it was definitely my car, but mm, 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 mm. but I I wasn't getting out of any like suspicious vehicle or anything like that. If that's what you mean. You own a lot of cars. I love cars, motorcycles. I can see that. You don't have any cars that match the description of the one you was driving. I mean, if I was driving a vehicle that I owned and got rid of it there, oh. I guess I wouldn't have it anymore, right? I want to know about this weapon that you found. Oh, yeah. That that was... Uh, just found that, it in a car. People just leave that shit around in a car, sir. That was in a car, yeah. If I find one again, I'll definitely turn it in Whose here. Whose car was it in? I have no idea. I'll be honest with you, I could very well take your farm's license, sir. Oh, no. Convince me why you should keep it. Well, I wasn't, you know, being violent in any way. I just happened to be in a certain area of the city that you felt was suspicious and... And looked like somebody that was driving a suspicious vehicle, I guess. No, you know, I, was... I followed you straight from where you took the car all the way to that <laughs> spot, I mean, sir. You, you, did, you didn't see me have any firearms out or anything like that, right? I wasn't shooting. I don't have any you know, gunshot residue on my hands. Sir, if trying... you are caught with a weapon like that again, I will make a note on your profile that your weapon's license should be revoked immediately. Do you understand? I understand. You are going to receive the charge for that firearm. It's going to be criminal possession of a Class 2 weapon. I'm also going to charge you with Grand Theft Auto Alpha for stealing that car and tampering. For disappearing that car. What car? Mr. Flair. I love cars. And motorcycles. Yeah? Yep. Trucks, too. Oh, perfect. I could tell. Which do you prefer? Cars, trucks, or motorcycles? Oh, I prefer cars. You want to tell me about uh, the money on your person or the weird uh, car parts, Freon? Huh. I didn't even notice they were in my pockets. Radio, a battery. Doing with an airbag. An airbag? Yeah. Huh. I, and Vicodin. I... Why you got Vicodin, sir? Vicodin. I don't know where that any of that stuff came from. No idea. I did not see those go into my pockets. I didn't place them there. 
you, you didn't put those things on you. So somebody has kidnapped you and snuckily put those things on your person. I have definitely not been kidnapped today. I'm that's I'm not too sure. The the Vicodin would be nice because uh you know it's good for you know when I hurt my my shoulder and stuff. I do wreck motorcycles a lot, so well, that's a controlled substance and you need a prescription for that. Oh, yeah. Where do I get the prescriptions again? Uh, you can try the hospital, but I don't think they're going to be prescribing you Vicodin. Okay, okay. Last time they told me to take Tylenol. Uh, uh, and ibuprofen. Tylenol and ibuprofen. I, I be, ibuprofen. How do you plead to I, those charges, sir? Ibuprofen. Um, so... This is my first time being in here. I I have to plead guilty or not guilty, I assume. You can also plead no contest. That's an option. No contest, okay. You can also consult a lawyer if you'd like. Um, so many so options. Could you remind me of the the charges again? Uh, it's going to be criminal possession of a class two farm tampering in Grand Theft Auto Alpha. What was the tampering part? Oh, disappear in the car. Uh, I don't don't remember the car part uh, or the Grand Theft Auto part. No, you don't. But I def definitely had that firearm on me. That 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 was a hard lesson learned. Uh. So I either have to do guilty to all, not guilty to all, or no contest. Pretty much. If you want to plead not guilty to some of them, you can go out on bail, but you'll still have to go out on bail for all of them. I'll just make oh, a note. Okay. Okay. I mean, there's like nothing you can do about the the car part that was kind of a mystery. So that I can plead guilty to the firearm part that I I definitely was in the wrong on. Sir, it's not a mystery. I felt like it was pretty mysterious. I'm gonna, I'm gonna disagree there. I'm gonna disagree. You went and dropped that car off at that feller there. Know that exactly feller. what happened. Do you know that feller's name by any chance? I don't know his name. He don't like me, but I know what he does. Hmm. So what, what's, uh, what's the time? What's the, uh, what's, what, what's all involved if I plead guilty? You're looking at six thousand dollars in citations and up to fifty-five <laughs> months at Bolingbroke State Penitentiary. Oh my goodness! All that for a firearm and uh, a mysterious car that went poof. Yeah. Makes it kind of hard to to plead guilty today, though. Um. I'll plead guilty if you either help me out with the charges or give me a taser. Because I, I like firearms, too. And tasers are cool. You'll plead guilty if I give you a taser 